Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to the show where tonight we've gone Tony Awards crazy. Tony Am I right, Jeff? Crazy. Crazy. We're having a real good time um. celebrating the work of... Hey, that's what I should do. Musicals. <laughs> Yeah. That's it, man. When I get done with the show at the end of the year, I'll go to Broadway. They'll love me. They'll think I'm like... That's a great idea. Yes. Yeah. Yes. That's a great idea. They'll be, they'll be like, hey, it's Liza Minnelli. I was you... a late night douche. We could, do, we could do a musical, you and me together. We could be uh, Craig and the Angry Robot. That's, uh, yes, that's right. We could, this is it, Craig. We could tell our story on stage. In song. In song. <laughs> now, let's know. All right. Uh, what time is it, Jeffrey? It's Jeffrey? treat mail time. Time to take advice from a man who just used the force to scratch an itch on his dark side. <laughs> With a jingle, would you? This is from Scott in London, England. You ever been there? Oh, yeah, right. Oh, right. right. Uh, now, why did you go into Australian there? Did no, you meet I, an Australian I, I, person I, I, when I you were in I made a choice there, and then I went the other way. Oh, okay. <laughs> right. We should talk like this for the rest of this email. Right, talk yeah. in his sort of Cockney, hello, Gavna. Yeah, right. <laughs> right, all right. Would you like it up the chimney, sir? <laughs> yeah, only, only if you wear a foam finger. Right. <laughs> That's all right, right. I'm a chimney sweeper. Right, so yeah. would, you like, would you like the brush to yeah, grab your chimney? You're right, exactly. Yeah right, yeah, right. All right, dear Craig, would you have any interest in playing a villain on Foil's War now that you have some free time this winter? Well, first of all, thank you for the sensitive nature of your tweet. <laughs> I'd love to be a villain on Foil's War. Oh, that'd be that'd great. Be, it's your favourite show, man. Yeah, it is my favourite show. It's on, it, it's, on the, it's on the British television. <laughs> The British TV. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, they've got a name for it. What is it? Can you not say the name of it? Is that? Uh, no, I think I can say it. Yeah. Is it the Is it the BBC? No, it's not that one. It's it, the other one. It's the other one. Yeah. BBC America. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that one. Okay, I got it. All right. <laughs> um, yeah, that's a great show. With he, he's a detective and he solves crimes. He's like, oh, this seems to have been a murder. <laughs> And he wears the hat. I watched an episode. I finally watched one. Oh, you, did you like it? Very good. Yeah, he wears a hat like this, right? Yeah, 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 right. Yeah, yeah. And then it's like, you know, there's, there's been a, all you uh, Germans, get over there. <laughs> You're absolute, absolute, what an absolute shower. Get over there. Get in the back of that van and go over there. I, I am so sorry that I have been naughty. I apologize for my crimes. Yeah, as well. <laughs> Yeah, well, you Germans have been very naughty in this war, and you, uh, you're not going to win it, so just give me your gun and go and stand over there in the corner and think about what you've done. All right, but, but here's my gun, but it wasn't my fault. He told me to do it, and I just thought it was something fun to do. I'm sorry, I won't do it again. Please don't hurt me. Please. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you. All right, very good. <laughs> anyway, uh, this is from Annabelle in Columbus, Ohio, says, Craig, is it true that Jeff is taking over your show in December? <laughs> what? Is that true? No, 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 no. Jeff, how no, could no. you? No, man, I would never, I would never go back, I would never, I would, it's absolutely true, it's gonna happen. <laughs> no, man, that's not true, I'm being turned into a leaf blower after this is over. <laughs> you know that. I think I've seen you blow leaves before, before, it was when we were in Toronto, yeah, I think. That's right, uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Hey! Hey! Let, no. Shut up! Now let me tell you something. Let me tell. Hey! Let me explain something to you, studio audience, if that's what you call yourself. When you ooh like that, you alert the sensor, the, the sensor that there may be something untoward going on. Until that moment, they're asleep. <laughs> but when they hear ooh, they go what? And they lift up their head from their journal and they lick their quill and they say, No, Craig, you will not say any naughty words on your late night show because you were a fat little boy.
I may have taken it too yeah, far. Yeah, no, yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Through a commercial, would sure, you? man. We'll be back after this with the show that's not like any other late night talk show. 